successful and famous Jewish hip-hop artists on the planet have adapted Adam Sandler's iconic Hanukkah song for this year's holiday. Nassim Black and Kosha Dills dropped the video for the Hanukkah song 2.0 ahead of this year's Festival of Lights. It's a reimagining, a loving homage to Sandler's 1995 breakout hit. The pair are some of the best-known Jewish rappers making music today. Both of them, Israeli-Americans, the catchy song, and the music video filmed recently on the streets of Midtown Manhattan. The two are going on a national tour this month called the Bright Lights Tour. Miracles happen on 34th Street to me. Seven days in a week, we got a nice. I see you smile on my face. Freestyle for living. Took big L's and like the only enemy is if the Knicks ain't winning. I'm in the streets with peeps and every day I'm chilling. 2021, my only job was living for a living. Please listen, I'm being grateful. Got heat, got hot. What about my own fry food? We outside till we inside. We actually been fighting hatred and bigotry our whole lives. Had a slice of the life, but now I want the whole pie. Got a tip for every hater that don't tip the pizza guy. Thousands of years ago, we fought against the Greek fire. Now we order in veggie burgers and Greek diners. Stay working on yourself, be a miracle, don't retire. Put the oil in the lamp and be a lighter. Come on, everybody, it be popping off. It was just Thanksgiving, how the heck it Hanukkah? Get a present VHS, tape Nintendo DVD, and an NFT from Gary V. With us now is Kosha Dills. Uh, I want to ask Kosha, thank you so much for being with us. This is an incredible uh, you know, rap song, an incredible uh, story you're telling with this song, but the original, the inspiration, Kosha, tell me what that Adam Sandler song means to you, both back in the 90s and even now when you listen to it, you know, decades later. Uh, thanks, Jeff. Um, you know, it's like the classic song, Adam Sandler's never-ending gift to humanity. I think the song is basically for anyone who's like the little hint of Jewish taste, they know the, you know, Hanukkah song. So it's like the thing that's in the WhatsApp groups and um, where people are like, you know, it's time to remake the song. And imagine if you could be the second most known Hanukkah song ever. And um, that's what we're doing. You yeah. know, we're, we hope to make it, you know, and I think we're like on that track <laughs> to be the second most known Hanukkah song. So I think that's a that's a good situation for us to be in. Sandler famously did like kind of this long list, you know, famous Jews. It was, you know, very funny, very catchy back in the 90s. Your lyrics, the theme of the Hanukkah song 2.0, it's a little bit different, a little more, you know, serious in ways, talking about the actual holiday and its meaning for the Jewish people. Tell me kind of the messaging you're going for. For my lyrics, I feel like... Um, the message was, you know, to be like uplifting. It was supposed to be, we were sort of, you know, try to be funny, but you're never going to be as funny as Adam Sandler. But, you know, to have like an uplifting message for 2021, I guess, is the main goal. And I think I just try to hit the mark, you know, and to have a good rap song. I think it's really hard to have a mix of funny and being dope as a rapper. And that was really what we wanted to do. So I didn't want it just to be, I feel like if you think of Jewish songs, you always know, think of it's always a parody or it's always a real it's supposed to be funny but to ride the lines of like being a dope rap song being lyrical having good beats um and just riding all those things to the t is difficult to do but that's you know that's our goal yeah so. uh, not just to be a parody or not just to be funny but also as yeah. you said ride that line of also a real song a real song yeah. so you know you guys are probably the most famous Jewish hip-hop duo alive today. I mean, you're on tour. But the idea, though, right, of Jewish rappers, Jewish hip-hop guys, it catches a lot of people off guard. People raise their eyebrows a little bit. Uh, are you still kind of surprised when people express disbelief that, you know, Jews could make it in the hip-hop world? No, because we're real rappers. I mean, I know Nassim since 2008. I know um, that what, what people that follow us maybe not know, but I've known the scene is before he was even Jewish. I think that, you know, one, you got to be a dope rapper. Two, sure, you're Jewish. But three, be able to, like, transcend communities. So that's the hip-hop community, Jewish community, pop culture community. Learn how to bring all those things together in a timely fashion. Um, 
if other people don't get it, that's not our, that's not my issue for sure. So it's just consistency of being dope, delivering, and making sure you can deliver the song in the right way and get it out to the people. So I, I mean, <laughs> have you had any reaction really yet just, from Adam Sandler himself? I mean, I mean, have, this is going viral as it should. Has he reached out to you? Do you hope to reach? He reaches out to you. Yeah, a lot of people that know Adam Sandler have reached out to us. I think a lot of people that have, um, that everyone says like they know someone who knows Adam Sandler. I guess it's like a typical Jewish story that somebody knows somebody. Um, <laughs> but, you know, listen, I just want more and more people to hear it. You know, if someone else could share it, awesome. But I think, uh, you know, it, the original song is the best song, right? I mean, it's the song that we all know. And he updated that song. So I want more people to know that song. And, you know, listen, there's 7 billion people in the world. I think everyone should hear the Hanukkah song from Adam Zandler. And if we could get just a little fraction of that, <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm cool with that. Was this filmed in one night? I mean, you guys were in Midtown Manhattan, you know, some of the most famous sites in the city. Uh, it's, a, it's a great video. How long did it take to put it together? Um, it was a couple hours in, uh, on Thanksgiving. We filmed it on Thanksgiving. So we got Gary Vaynerchuk in there. We got our video. Um, and there was probably like six hours. We did it one night. I did a little bit on Tuesday and then a little bit on Thursday. And, and that's really it. I mean, we just kind of got a Hanukkah miracle, kind of pulled it off. Hanukkah, eight, eight <laughs> hours. You know, you got it in eight hours. You got it one night. They did the Hanukkah <laughs> miracle for Kosher Dills and for, and for Nisim Black. Thank you so much uh, for being with us. And yes, congratulations. Sir on the success of this video and this song so far. And happy Hanukkah to you, man. Yes. And, and and we hope that you guys come see us on tour. You know, where we have a tour. It starts, it starts uh, Monday night in, uh, at SOBs in New York City. So if you're in New York City, come, come hang out on the last day of Hanukkah and, and take us out.